this was the location of where the package is supposed to be dropped, like the health facility where the package is going to be dropped. Like this, and it also has the flight, uh, the software that our drones use. So the, ch uh, the smart chargers, they can also be able to cool the battery in case we have high temperatures, and they can also be able to to heat the battery in case we have low temperatures that are being uploaded to our server. Okay. Yeah, so that's one component, the battery. So on this other side, uh, components, the battery, the wind, uh, the drone, and the nose cone, normally it's about our drone which is yeah, so your excellence and the scan the package, that is just to tell the drone that the package you're carrying is going to the health facility on this uh, on this drone, yeah. Mm. Okay, so, 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 okay. Okay. so the drone is also doing unit tests to ensure that all the students have still some errors the drone is detecting. So it has to ensure one by one. Yeah, one by one. So it, it has to ensure that all the errors one by one are clear. So we will reach Homa Bay, we will reach Kericho, we can reach Nandi, we can reach Vihiga, we can reach Kitsi, and we can reach Nyamira. So it's our route from here, we are able to fly there and get from between 5 to 35 minutes maximum. And we will continue working with you, we send up Buna at EIZ Services, Kachika Hospital is in, and I hope it will come and change lives in the community. Thank you very much. Hello, face of the use of drone technology for deliveries of medicine, veterinary, and other health products in Kisumu County. This is historic because it marks the first ever drone delivery in Kisumu, if not in the entire Republic of Kenya. This innovative technology is as a result of the good partnership relations between the larger lead region economic law of LRA counties and Zipline in support of universal health care access and the growing animal industry in our counties. As you know, milk is an essential product of the life of human beings, if not other animals as well. I am hopeful that this test flight today will pave the way for the final processes towards full deployment of the technology in the region. You will agree with me, ladies and gentlemen, that our county still has a number of challenges in delivery of healthcare services. These include data collection and transmission systems, health financing, human resources development, essential infrastructure and primary health care settings and supply chain, access to medical attention, among others. 